जी बिफोर वी मूव टूवर्ड्स टेकिंग क्वेश्चन आई वुड लाइक टू एड समथिंग रिगार्डिंग इन एफिशेंसी ऑफ दिज ट्रेडिशनल और कन्वेंशनल बैंकिंग सिस्टम आई थिंक दिस वी हैव नॉट डिस्कस सो फार Inflation is the byproduct of this uh, traditional banking system. <laughs> so I believe it's the time to move towards uh, the other kind of banking where we can really keep some sort of uh, uh, reserve that would uh, uh, help us avoiding this inflation. And I think maybe this Bilal Baba and uh, this uh, uh, cryptocurrency as well as the other banking system they I'm speculating maybe they would solve this problem. So the first, uh, let's say, crypto is Bitcoin, and Bitcoin was born uh, reacting against the inefficiencies of the system. So because we have a system where uh, some central uh, authorities are printing money without our consultation, so it's not democratic, and through inflation, they are controlling the economy. And you see all the problems around the world right now with the, with the, with inflation. So, uh, what is solving Bitcoin is that we have a coin that is free to use. No, nobody that, uh, that doesn't don't, don't want, they don't they don't have to use it. So it's free to use. It's a digital coin for a digital world, okay? And there is a certain amount of uh, coins in the market. Nobody can print more. So, what does it mean? It means that more people using. more adoption more digitalization the price of each coin will increase because nobody can uh, modify the supply and you are free to use it or not but you can trust more in this coin because you know that is decentralized there is nobody modifying the laws in in it depends of their own interest not in the interest of the people so it's more democratic and uh, and and but of course it's solving inclusion okay it's solving inclusion and then through smart contracts technology that was promoted through ethereum start new kind of generation coins okay and now we have plenty of coins <laughs> all of uh, uh, each coin is solving different uh, issues okay but this is the important so that you can choose coins that they are built with uh, a terms and conditions that are written in a code there is no government that can modify there is no lawyer that can say tomorrow we are going to change that because i think that is better no no is built in a code forever and and you cannot touch it and if you don't like it don't use it if you want to use dollars use dollars if you want want to use ethereum use ethereum but uh, this is very important but it's fixing the structural problems of the current actual, uh, financial system imagine if you check your uh, cpa index of last 10 15 years the thing which you would buy for uh, $1 maybe today it's for $50 so it's flaw of the uh, conventional banking system Uh, how uh, how much it cost uh, either 3 years ago uh, one big mac in mcdonalds hmm. how much it cost right now more than double it's double almost yeah yeah more than double your salary grow twice uh, two times no your salary uh, the salary of the workers didn't grow two times so what happens so you are changing your time working getting less money less value the same money but less value so uh, you are poor Mm. Every day you are more poor and working the same. Mm. So this is crazy. This is why also cryptocurrencies become so uh, trendy and people is like adopting because it's one of the few ways that uh, to scream to the system, hey, something is wrong, and I am choosing to use this coin instead of use uh, dollar, for instance. Okay, it's it's the way to 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 do something mm. to escape from the system. Let's say.